Work the fuck out. Prepare yourself, man. This life ain't fair. It just is not fair, man. You expect to see a kid grow. And the motherfucker did. I'm going to tell you this. You got to give us a, something, a brain to use it. This is another thing that women, that people do. I feel bad for kids. You kids, goddamn. Parents with kids. Y'all motherfuckers need to get, y'all need a button too. Y'all need a parent button that says don't do, do dumb shit with your kids. Or to your kids. I'm for real. And this should be a, a do-over button for you motherfuckers. Like, well, I got kids. I fucked up. I'm for the Achilles bitches. I'm in the car with the the uh, carbon monoxide going. Uh, I'm abusing my kids. Fuck a guy. Give me a do-over button. I should be able to hit a reset button. Boom. You have no kids now. Their lives have been erased. You motherfuckers are free. You don't have to even tell nobody. You ain't got to have the stigma of having an abortion. I am God. I just wiped this out. Move on. Rewind back in the back when that nut was coming and there was a baby coming. See? Why do we have to sit on the news and hear about a motherfucker locking their kids up in motherfucking cages? Got their 22 and 26-year-old kid in a motherfucking cage starving their motherfucking kids. That is not fair. My fucking brain ain't going to work right seeing a man keep his kids in a motherfucking cage. Who does that, Lord? Can you help a nigga out? Help a brother out, Lord, with that so I can hit a button and it's over with. Oh, Lordy, 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 Lordy. It's your boy. I just like to just talk, man. It's just I know. I'm not going to uh, keep y'all too long, but it's just talking about life, man. It's comedy. It's everywhere. I just think I love life, but it's just some things are not fair. It's just, I'm telling you, it's not fair. It is not fair at all. It's almost not as fair as your favorite sport team or your heroes falling. That shit is so fucking wrong, God. God! I ain't going to say it's wrong. I'm just saying it's not fair for me to see my heroes or my favorite team not win or not be successful in the lifetime. I think that is sad. I'm a Dallas Cowboy fan. We ain't had shit pop off since the 90s. I ain't happy. I am not happy. I am not happy. I do. I love Mike Tyson. I don't think it's fair, Lord, for Mike Tyson to go out the way he went out. I want a motherfucker to be like Floyd Mayweather, go out on top. I, I just think that, it's, it's, it, and I think that once in my life, in every person's life, they should be able to fuck the person they want to fuck. I don't give a fuck who she is. Let's put her, let's click the button you know, on the app that you're going to give her the God app or the you know, do-over app or whatever, and we click that part of the app and says, Damn, Janet, I would love to fuck the shit out of you. I'm just saying, don't be taking this the wrong way. I'm just saying. And if you young and you hearing it, your ass supposed to be in the bed or, or supposed to be playing with your friend, talking about some pity pat. Stop listening to stuff like this because this ain't for you to listen to. And it better not be done to my kid. If your little ass is under 18, you should stop right now. Turn this off because it's grown folk talking. <laughs> Hey, a lot of you parents, it ain't fair for y'all to let y'all kids be grown either. Y'all know that, right? Stop letting your kids watch you suck dick. That ain't right. Stop letting your kids see you eat pussy. Stop telling your kids how to do shit that grown folks do. That's just not fair. Let them little motherfuckers grow up and, 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 and go through the shit you do trying to figure out how to add two plus two while you got to pay the rent and, and you done went and slapped your mama and told your mama you don't give a fuck about it. Then you got to realize you shouldn't have slapped your mama. You needed your mama. You should, everybody should learn the hard way like we all learn. Stop letting your kids be grown, okay? I'm tired of seeing these teachers fighting with grown fucking kids. I ain't talking about physically grown just like Marianne, could you please sit down 
Uh, John, pass your homework up. Marianne, please. Yo, bitch, who the fuck you talking to, bitch? You don't know who you talking to, bitch? I put these hands on you, bitch. I put these bees down on you, bitch. Bitch, don't we fucking watch your mouth, bitch. You don't know the fuck who the fuck I am, bitch. Who the fuck you talking to, bitch? Oh, my gosh. Hey, y'all remember that one? Let me tell you something ain't fair, too. It ain't by life. Common sense. It's not fair that all of us start losing our fucking brain at the same time. Like on certain issues, all of our brains are like fucked up. Like we can't pick and choose shit to be fucked up if we know it's different. So let me tell like this. Barack Obama. If you motherfuckers don't stop saying that he's black, this motherfucker part black. He mixed. Motherfucker, I just told y'all about mixture. He's mixed. They can do what a mix mean. You can't go out and get Coke in Hennessy and say, what you drinking, bro? I'm drinking Hennessy. No, bitch. You drinking Hennessy and Coke. Say that shit, bitch. Say that shit, bitch. Explain that. Say you're smoking, you're drinking Hennessy and Coke. Bitch, you go out and drink some weed and put some cocaine in it. You're not drinking weed. You're not smoking weed no more, bitch. So it's a mixture. And I just think that somebody somewhere down the line need to help us and help us focus. I'm for real, man, because this life ain't fair, man. It ain't fair for all of us to be stupid at the same time. It is not fair. Like, listen, man, everybody hates Donald Trump. That does not make sense. Donald Trump's a moron. Bitch, do you know any motherfucking moron? Everybody's a Look, if everybody sit back and breathe... <sighs> Name me one president that had it all. That was a genius. Okay. Nothing. See? Name me motherfucker that was so... We love Barack Obama. Why? Because he's black? No, bitch, he's mixed. He's not, he's not chocolate. This motherfucker is cocoa. He's mixed. You ain't getting your coffee straight, motherfucker. You getting your coffee with cream. Coffee with cream is a mixture. You got a frappuccino or some shit. You got something mixed. Oh, it ain't fair, man, for us all to be idiots. Like, I be laughing, like, when I be around black people, sometimes my black people, boy, they get crazy over stupid shit. And there's nobody having a conversation. Okay, so a little bit of what they do, what they do. So everybody's chilling. We go somewhere, we go eating. So one of the kids uh, asked the uh, waitress for something stupid, like, uh, I want, I don't want a uh, yard house. I don't want this food. Uh, okay, well, you're in the yard house, and that's what we do. Well, I want Chipotle. Y'all got Chipotle? Well, I can't handle Chipotle. <laughs> you can't have Chipotle because this is not a Chipotle place. Mama! See, that lady told me, fuck her. Stop asking her dumb shit. No, ma'am, I didn't say that. Bitch, what you just say? Uh, I didn't say anything. I just told your kid, this is yard house. It's not Chipotle. We don't have Chipotle here. That's all I said. No, you telling me, you call, you telling my bitch, my, you, bitch, you telling my daughter, see, you, ma, hold me, don't hold me. I'm going I'm to I'm get with this bitch. Hold on, what you say again, bitch? Ma'am. Why are you calling me bitches? Yeah, why you call? Yeah, wait, 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 bitch. I want to know why you telling my little niece. You telling her some shit. She at Chipotle. What the fuck? You trying to get, get trying to get small with her? Huh, bitch? Yeah, bitch. You can't get fucked. We'll whoop your motherfucking ass up in there. And then everybody want to get mad and whoop the bitch. They all go crazy at the same time. That's not fair. It's not fair. It's just not fair for all these people to lose their brain at the same time. It is not. Why the hell will God allow us to lose our brains at the same time? They was it. All of a sudden, whoever lost their brain, somebody finna get, somebody finna die, somebody finna lose an eye, somebody finna lose an arm, somebody finna have something. It's just, listen. I know that I am not the only person that hates this. Tell me, that I know there's a parent out here in this world. There has to be a parent out here in this world that has lost a child to some type of mob violence, some type of situation where everybody lost their motherfucking brain at the same time. That is not fair. Like, seriously, you send your kid to the baseball game. 
at the high school. They get to the high school and there's a fight. Some little boy then got a gun from his cousin, his uncle, or off the streets. He should not. You should not. We should not lose somebody because of some stupid shit that another motherfucker did. And then all of a sudden, a whole group of people say, yeah, we South Side bitch. Kill that bitch. And now it's a whole stadium full of killers because this is South Side High School. Oh, that's North Side or that's Northeast or whatever. All these people lose their mind at the same goddamn time. There should be a stop button on that. You know what I'm saying? Like, literally, if it's f two or more people, it should automatically be like, you shall not do this. It should just freeze everybody. It should motherfuckers just don't go back, rewind, and we'll send them to an automatic planet where the motherfuckers go to some rehab. We should uh, not all lose our brain at the same motherfucking time. That is a scary shit. We all conceded to do the same motherfucking thing at the same motherfucking time. Crazy ass shit. All right. I know I said a lot of cussing. I apologize. I could have used better words. Maybe there's a cuss button because these cuss words are old as hell. I be hating when I hear young kids cuss because it's so old. Like, who's still using shit in 2019? If a mother, if a if a person is still using motherfucker, you motherfucker, I couldn't even be offended by some old ass ancient word. It's like I still be tripping on people talking about nigger. Like nigga, that was 19. No what? Shit, I don't even know what. You, 1400s we still tripping over nigger like listen literally i watched this uh, uh youtube video about a teacher some kid was you know watching the kid so the kid said what's up my nigga and i think the teacher replied like ain't nothing my nigga you chilling yeah nigga that's what black people use that word. I, you fucking niggas is get you black niggas is gone crazy with that shit. Like motherfucker, don't change your attitude and your mindset for uh, for an instant. All of a sudden, everybody go crazy. Oh, I can't believe they use the word nigger. It's like look when a bitch use the word bitch, be like bitches be using the word bitch. That's some crazy shit. Like literally. That's some dumb shit that God need to eradicate. Like, if you use the word nigga freely and to everybody around you, and you say, what's up, my nigga? And then the white guy says, yeah, nigga. And you mad. <laughs> like, I can never understand that. It's like me understanding Dill Hoogly. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you, bro? You got 40% common sense. 10% of genius and that other 50 is just like I'm just saying shit just throw that shit out there uh, Steve Harvey made a comment well let me talk to the president all of a sudden all the other motherfuckers went crazy at the same time and all of a sudden you can't even speak to the motherfucking president of the United States of America are you motherfucking crazy but your ass is kissing everybody's ass Barack ain't one the only motherfucking president oh dumb ass people see we need a button don't be dumb. I don't give a fuck who the president is. I'm going to respect him until I say, fuck America. Does that make sense to y'all? I'm going to say, fuck him until I say, fuck America. If I say, fuck America, then I'm going to be like, fuck the president. If I'm not saying, fuck America then I'm not going to say fuck the president because I'm still with you. You know, it's like saying fuck my mama. And I, I'm in the house with my daddy. I'm not going to say shit to my mama or to my daddy. Thank you. Until I'm done with my mama and my daddy at the same time. And my brothers, my sister, my uncle, my cousin, everybody. I'm through with every motherfucker. It's like, I can't, that's the dumb shit. Somebody need to stop some of this dumb shit. We need a button, bro. For real, though. We need a button that's just, we can, somebody need to click so we can stop doing dumb shit, acting dumb shit. Life just ain't fair. 
<sighs> All right, it's your boy OG now. I'm going to go give me some water. I'm chilling. I'm going to give me some water because I'll be chilling. <laughs> All right, thank y'all for your time. God bless you. See you later. Bye.